Hey guys, what's going on? King 56 here, back at the title screen of Spelunky. Spelunky? I've never played this game before. Maybe I have. Maybe 29 episodes of it was enough. Maybe not. Let's try 30. This is episode 30. We're gonna go to hell this episode. And for this episode, to pick a character, you know, that'll get us to hell, I think we should pick a character that we got from beating the game. So let's pick Mr. Jaguar Man here. We could do it. We could do it. A little bit more random character selection lately, so... Uh, I, I, I'm going to improve, I'm, I'm telling you this right now, because this is, I solemnly swear, put my hand on a Bible, and I solemnly swear that I will not tell a lie in this courtroom. I don't know why I'm in England doing a American court procedure, but still, I'll be successful in this run. But I'm gonna, that, that's what I deserve for that uh, accent, by the way. <laughs> Starting off early and often with taking the damage. I like it. Starting off early and often, though, with doing this is not as good. So we're gonna... We are gonna hurt our damsel there, unfortunately, for our damsel's sake. But it was obviously for a good cause. For the cause, that was three ropes. So we can probably use it to our advantage by going down this way. Oh, whoo, you're coming down with me, sir. I'm gonna miss some gems going to because I didn't go this way, but I feel as if I'm okay in missing those because I might be able to go back and actually grab them. So who actually knows at this point what I can and can't do. I am, however, missing a crate, so it may be worth it to bomb or to rope up and then see now here's the deal, here's the issue that I'm struggling with immediately is how the hell Am I going to have to use more ropes? Like, that's that's the only thing that I'm worried about here. But since I got three in the crate, and I'm probably, with my luck, not going to get any bombs with the next one. So, I'm probably going to end up using three in general just for this one crate. So, that, you know, is good and bad. But we're going to go down and do it anyway. We're troopers today. We're not going to leave any stone unturned, any crate object area unchecked. It's go time. And quite frankly, yeah, see, I told you about that. We were going to end up using a lot of those ropes so that's okay though we're not gonna leave as i was saying any stone unchurned anything unchecked because we're going to hell this run this this episode and if that's not the case then we'll just try again <laughs> not like i'd be arrested for perjury or anything right i just swore on the bible i don't know i don't i don't know man now hmm i want to wait here just for a second i want to see if because i don't want to kill my damsel Primarily, obviously. Oh, I, I have a skull up here. How could I have almost forgotten this nice little skull for me here? Thank you very much. Hopefully we drop this one right. There we go. Perfect. See, there were no uh, animals or pests in those pots. So if we, you know, tried to risk it and say, oh, there might be an animal there. Nope, there wasn't. So we would have gotten hit and our damsel would have died, which would have been terribly unfortunate and I'm taking damage like no one else here so let's just get the hell out of here before I take any more stupid damage oh it hurts to say I know I thought I'd be playing more careful carefully I should say but I guess I'm not but we're gonna get a snake pit here so that means we're gonna get a matok or a matic if you are more like me in, in pronunciation so we might even get the opportunity here to grab some paste and a bat and more damage so that's obviously not ideal but regardless we're gonna get pace we're gonna get some oh my gosh this is so worth it three crates dude definitely worth the bomb for them so let's actually grab those up right now and I'm gonna have to use a rope here aren't I shit god I'm such an idiot there's a pot here oh well that didn't work, did it? No. Oh my lordy lordy. Hmm. I'm gonna use another rope here. You know what? I'm just gonna waste all my ropes. And I'm gonna kill myself. Cause this is this is just not the run I'm looking for right now. I don't think I've done that before. I don't think I've intentionally caused my own death. Th that's just that was my warm up, right? That that's we'll just call that the warm up. Psst, it was the warm up. So that was my first run. I wanted to see how I did, and obviously not good enough to. To show, to have dough to show for my for my go there, but I can still rhyme it just like any other MC out there, because apparently I'm a master of ceremonies now. But hey, that's 
I guess I'm moving up in the world, right? I'm moving up in the DJ world. Well, not exactly quite a DJ if you're an MC now, are you? Probably not. All right, you're dead. I hate these bats, man. They are so sensitive. You know, if they could just put aside their differences and not be so gosh darn sensitive for once in their lives, we might be okay. I do not know that there was... I didn't know there was gold there, but that's okay. We, we got some gold back. Okay, let's... That spider killed himself, which makes things so much easier for me. Not that I, you know, would wish suicide upon any bat. Actually, you know what? I'm going to say it right now. I am anti-bat. So all bats should commit suicide in Spelunky. In Spelunky, mind you. I would hate to see any sort of rare, un obscure species of bat go extinct on my account just because I told them to kill themselves. Not going to happen on my watch, so I'm going to make this distinction clear for you. But anyways, we're going to go down. Sil silliness aside, we still need to continue on. After our latest suicide, I mean, that was pretty bad. That fall damage was also pretty terrible, but I'm, I'm hoping that I can fall right into a jetpack in this area. I guess not. That's unfortunate. I'm going to buy both of these items because spring shoes are pretty sweet, as well as the pitcher's mitt because of your increased throwing. And I think those are two items that... You don't really come across too much in shops, and for 4,000 each, I mean, that's pretty cheap. We'll probably make that back on this floor. So that's a pretty good that's a pretty good trade, I would say. That was also close, almost hurt myself there. But that shopkeeper, unfortunately, is cutting off us from most of the level. And that really does suck, and we're not going to get any bombs from this either. So we're going to toss this over this way, and I don't want to piss off the shopkeepers. I've learned my... I think I finally learned my lesson. I'm not actively trying to... Uh, piss off any shopkeepers around here but let's just just leave it at that and go down again i mean i'm not really happy with that level i uh, don't know anything about a chest and a key and unfortunately we could have possibly missed it on that floor because we had no visibility otherwise but i'm gonna hold out and say that we we were fine there but i guess that remains to be seen as well oh i love the pitcher's mitt so much that king cobra almost could have hurt us but he obviously didn't just gonna make sure of that even that killed our, that bat for us. Man, look at all these crates. This is this is pretty awesome. I kind of wish I had paste, and I can get down, or I can get to the damsel area from below, so I'm not going to worry about that either. And I have three extra bombs that I did not have before, which is always just scrump diddly umptious for us. Is that a Winnie the Pooh saying? It sounds like it could be. I don't... What is with me in my lore lately? I don't even know. I need to... I need to fix that I guess I, I honestly don't care but anyways is it worth using a rope for uh, 2500 yes especially since we're in need of the cash so I can't really say otherwise that that would be any worse or better but for now it's uh, definitely better anyways kind of wish I had the spike shoes but I do have the damsel and that makes things kind of nice I'm gonna toss you over there obviously we're gonna get full use out of you while I have you Okay, that bat obviously didn't hit me. You'd have to be you'd have to be an imbecile to believe that sort of trickery, but I guess these things kind of happen. I kind of want the idol now. I don't have paste. I kind of lost that opportunity before. So two bombs for 5 5 grand. Definitely worth it. I would say. I would say it is. Some people probably not so much, but I would definitely agree with that sentiment. Oh, we're not, we don't even need two bombs, it's one bomb. What the hell am I talking about? Don't know, personally, but that's okay. You don't always need to know what you're talking about. You do need to know, however, the locations of the spiders in this area. Holy shit, that was close. Alright, yeah, you can go down there. You're not disrupting anything bad, of course. Thank you very much. You might block the door, but I can always destroy you. Move you as I please. And he even left us a nice little emerald. How nice... See, we're, our money situation is looking a little bit better now, which I'm happy about, but I need this chest and key. Mind you, because this is it. This is the level where you need to get them, and this could be awful, so I'm just going to avoid it altogether, I think. Um, What do I do? Ah, okay, I can do that. Ooh, that was interesting, I guess. I kind of did not want to do that, because now I have to use a rope again. I wish I had climbing gloves for this specific reason, but... We can get some money out of this, so that's always a good thing. We need to look for our damsel now, I believe, because that would be the thing to do. 
We're gonna toss it this way. Oh, there's a King Cobra. Shit. Yeah, we're gonna... Perfect. That was close. That could have been a lot worse. Come here, Scorpion. Yep, I needed you to become deceased for me. Obviously, that was obviously something you wanted to do with your life, so that was always... I'm always happy to oblige that request. I really do want the damsel here, though. Although, would it be worth the millions of ropes I have to use to probably get it? Probably not. But that's okay. I think we missed the chest and key on level 2, because I don't see it at all. Which is really sad, for me at least. I don't know about you guys, you guys are probably indifferent. Which is just as fine. There's also an idol that we can grab up here. Although, I'm still holding out hope, because we can definitely still have an opportunity here. Our damsel is dead, that sucks. That bat is also dead though, so I guess an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. Oh, that's why. Cobra got him. Her, I mean. My apologies. Was there also a big spider here? Because there's two webs, but I guess not. Where is our chest and key, damn it? I guess we missed it. I guess we really did miss it. That sucks. Oh well. I guess we can still do, you know, the worm or the mothership and stuff like that. So that's always a good thing. Let's go up this way because there's no shopkeeper to piss off. Piss off then. Kill everybody, please. Thank you. Wow, that was a nice little maneuver I did there. Ah, look at that rock just clearing out all this territory for us. Yeah, bats are getting stuck everywhere. Snakes are getting stuck everywhere. King Cobras are killing things everywhere. It's a good day to be a spelunker. I'm gonna take the damsel's dead body as far as I can go because I need to save her, man. But as you can see, all resistance or all attempts will be futile. But now, see, here's the interesting thing. We can actually get a nice sacrifice here if we get lucky. Yes, we did. Perfect. We need to get to the worm level, so I kind of want a boomerang and I want the damsel. Because I want to save this character. I want to get a new character so I can show him off. Actually, we can toss you all the way over there. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. Alright, you're coming with me, buddy. Perfect. Oh, beautiful. You sacrificed a live man over there, and that is just about exactly what you need to start getting up your Cali count, which is nice. Now... Okay, we're gonna get you, obviously. Perfect. Okay, we're gonna get one more smack on you. We're going to sacrifice. See, we'll get an item out of this. What do we get? Oh, I guess not. That's odd. Hmm. I was almost certain that we were going to get an item for that. I, we don't need a machete at all. We do. Would, we would like a boomerang, though, because that would be the best. And I'm totally going to grab this damsel, and we'll, get, we'll go down on the worm. I think that's the best way to continue from here. We don't actually have a lot of bombs, which makes me a little bit more scared. And we only have one rope and no climbing gloves. So... Who knows, who knows anything right now? Is the damsel gonna go in the wormhole? No, not at all, that's fine. I'm gonna, I just wanted to place the boomerang in a more fortunate situation for us, so let's actually do that. Come on, there we go. All right, let's go down. Go to the wormhole, we haven't done this in, I think three episodes, so. It'll be interesting, I'm gonna obviously keep trying to do it while I can here, since we didn't get the key and the chest, so I mean, no Ujedi really, no. Hope for the run, I, I would unfortunately have to say. Ooh, we're even going to get a nice little crate here. Some more ropes for our special needs. I like it because, I mean, if we do beat it here, obviously we're going to continue on. So why the hell would I, you know. I remember smacking him too. That sucks. That really sucks. Let's restart, obviously. We, we got to the forest though, so not bad. I'm kind of sad at that, though. I really thought we'd pre we'd do pretty well with a boomerang and the worm. I don't know. It was all speculation, and it all came back to bite me in the ass when I made a mistake. But we're going to get some ropes, so I guess that's a good start. I guess that's okay. We can use a bomb here to get the damsel. There's plenty of moolah here to grab, as you can see. As you can plainly see, with eyes that are, you know, plain or, or however you season your eyes. Don't know. Don't know what... Do not know. Trust me, I don't. I'm going to grab this cash here, though. Because that would probably be favorable. And I don't think I'm missing much over to my right. But I'll check it out anyways. Just because there's there's arrow traps. There's there's fun to be had. There's there's probably food. Free food. That's always... You want to... You, 
Let me let me say this right now. You want to know the way to my heart? It is some free food. I like me some food. But who doesn't? I mean, that's kind of preaching to the choir here. I'm sure you guys are all part of your churches, your parishes, food choir. If you don't know what that is, I guess uh, you have no hope as a human being. And I, I just wasted a rope for $500. That's interesting. Definitely. But we can definitely do better. So let's just go down and, and, and just say that's that. I mean, we actually got about 10k, so I'd be pretty confident in buying a bomb box and not feeling bad about it, having no buyer's remorse, so we'll see about that, though, as well. There's a big spider up there. I kind of want to use this bat to access the spider, although we're going to get low on bombs inherently from it. But that's okay. I'm totally okay with being low on bombs if we have paste and we're going to get some money from this, and hopefully the shopkeeper has some pretty good stuff on him because that would be you know ideal obviously and oh do I waste my last bomb why yes yes I will I'm kind of playing a little bit more risky this time around but I I think that it'll pay off I'm going oh ooh, ooh. we have an altar here not bad I would I will use a rope for that that's that's damn I'm really sure about that one Shit, we have to use... Wow, okay. That was some quick thinking, but it was thinking that allowed us to continue, so that's good. I didn't want to waste the rope there, and I didn't. Anyways, do we buy the shotgun, or do we buy a various amount of other things? I'm kind of leaning on the mystery box right now. We got spring shoes from that, so not a bad exchange, although it was 8000 for a $4,000 item but I do like the item in general and it will make our mobility increase. So that's always good. Now, see the thing is, is I need a bomb to get back over that way and I don't have one. So I'm gonna have to use a rope and that's no good, unfortunately, but I do want to sacrifice this damsel. What is down this way? Hopefully the ability for me to get a bomb. If not, nope, that's fine. I'm just using all my items right now. It's, it's go for broke time. And that's fine. Kind of really am leaning on that shotgun because I want to get revenge on the worm for that. For the, him swallowing me. Yuck, yuck, yuck. But seriously. Let's go sacrifice our damsel first of all. Got a compass, which is nice. And the spring shoes makes things... Makes us actually able to get back out of here. Ooh, even better. We have that. Even better. That spider deserved to die. And I'm going to take this arrow down with me. Let's go down to 1-3. We definitely didn't miss the chest or the key here. Hopefully don't need a bomb to access either of them. But if we do, I hope there's obviously a shop within plain sight for us to use to access them. So, there's only one way to find out, so let's just go ahead and do the level. I don't know, there's a lot of bats here, and I'm kind of nervous about that. You know me, my, my history with bats, that's for sure. Yes, you all die now, thank you. There's our chest. Oh, almost hit myself with a rock. That was kind of weird. Okay, so this is all nothing that I want. So I might have to use, oh, I don't have to use a bomb to get the chest. So that is a positive. There's the key, do I have to use a bomb to get the key? No, it doesn't look like it. Just make sure I don't fall when I don't want to or something like that, because I have a feeling that if I fall wrong here, it could be the end. And that was just the end of my sanity. That was annoying. I'm gonna go crazy after that, obviously. That's what that means. And we're good to go down here. I was kind of worried about that skeleton and this one, but they're both fine. They both passed the test. What's the test, you say? Honestly, I don't know. The test is to get this gold and not get hit by the air trap, and we passed. We passed with flying colors. Some people are worried about finals, man. I'm just worried about passing spike traps on my way to school. Because I, I obviously live and breathe Splunky now, if you did not know. And I, yeah, was not going to deal with him. Let's go. Let's go down, we got the Ujet Eye, we have no bombs, we need to buy some from a shop, and we had not a lot of money from that floor, so not quite excited, but we're going to have ourselves our second sacrifice, hopefully, and that means we can get the Kapala. It's pronounced like Kap Kapala, but it's spelled C-A-Pala, so you're thinking to yourself, like, how do I pronounce this? I'm going to say, I don't know, you, you pronounce it how you want it. Oh, I thought that ruby was free, that's kind of funny anyways i don't want to piss off cali obviously and I, but i want that idol because it's good cash but there's plenty of money here it looks like so i'm not going to worry about it too much 
Give me my Kapala, man. Oh, beauty. Yeah, there's also a shopkeeper down there, so pissing him off would probably be the wrong move. But we're gonna get this crate, which I was looking at before. I was eyeing it intently, and now I, I claim my prize. I was the thousandth visitor to this website today, apparently. So I clicked on it, I gave him my credit card info, hopefully. Hopefully I can get my prize soon. I'm okay with buying that bomb box, by the way, even though we're so close to the forest. Because I'd rather have bombs, because that means we can't access the black market anyway. Shit. That 500 is not worth it. Let's go down. But we have the Kapala now, as I said, and that makes our health issue non-existent. As long as we farm correctly. But we still have to watch this Ujedi. We don't want to miss... <gasps> Ooh, we have a chance to go to the Black Knight's castle, as long as the... Gosh darn, what should we call? Oh, we're gonna get a shotgun out of this too. So we could go to the Black Knight's castle. I don't think you can kill those guys. Maybe you can, maybe you can't. Maybe it's Mario that taught me that bone fishes are bad. Well, Mario actually taught me all fishes are bad. That sucks. We can't actually go to the Black Knight's castle here. Uh, I do enjoy killing myself though, from time to time. Obviously, okay, that's yeah. You can die, obviously. Okay, I did see, like I said though, the pinging for the black market. And that's why we can't actually go to... We can't go anywhere. It's not reading Rainbow. Where is our black market, though? That much I want to know. It's pinging over here pretty fast. Oh, it's right between those two things. Okay. We can actually get the, the dead prince's crown or whatever he is. So that's... I want to... Toss a bomb that way. That seems to be pretty good. We can do a lot of stuff, actually, since we have more items than I originally expected us to have. So I'm going to drop off our damsel here. Unfortunately, but the thing about the dead of, is restless level is that you kind of get screwed and you can't get any blood for your Kapala. But I want to collect some cash. I want to collect our shotgun most of all, and I kind of hope that vampire is just dead. Just plain dead. And I'm kind of worried about... That doesn't look like he's dead. That was close. There you go. Okay, you can... That cape can just exist there. I'm not worried about that too much. And I want to get back out of here now. Oh, I can go up here. Perfect. I was going to say, I'm kind of puzzled now as to what I do. I don't have enough money for the... Whatchamacallit? The Ankh. But I do have a rope here that I can catch once I can trigger this ghost. But I'm going to get this emerald first. This will give us 10k, though, which is nice. We could go to that guy's... Uh, tombstone, but and we get another five grand from the crown, but I don't really care about that too much. So let's just go down. We have a shotgun, so and we oh, oh we do have enough money. Is it 15k for the idol? I'm not sure, but we get 20, we get another health, which is nice, and that means we also get the opportunity to compound on our wealth, which is always appreciated. Wait for this frog to jump once more. Perfect. Okay, you can die. Thank you. I do want to collect this blood very badly. There is a jetpack in here, but let me tell you right now, we probably will never get enough for it because the jetpack is about 32k, and we certainly don't have that amount. Although I'd really enjoy the opportunity to buy some nice things, like bombs. Ah, you can come this way. Yep, you're dead. Well, close to being dead. I would love to buy a kiss from the booth, that's for sure. And I don't see any opportunity to... I'm going to see if I can... Grab a little extra cash. We do have enough for a couple of bomb bags, though. I think I might actually take the opportunity to get some bomb bags. I'll see what else is being gambled for here. Do not need a boomerang at all. That's fine, though. I'm, I'm happy with grabbing bombs, for sure. What's over this way? Yeah, see, I just... I can't bring myself to killing the shopkeepers just for a jetpack, because... That will actually get us into trouble with shopkeepers if we don't have enough bombs, and there's not enough bombs really available here that I'd feel comfortable with to aptly take out all the shopkeepers in the future. So, oh well, it is what it is. I kind of want to kill this frog for the blood. Thank you. Let's go. -hoo -hoo -hoo. That was very sneaky and good at the same time we got through without getting hit by those spikes. Maybe we can get another Dead as Restless, because I really would like the opportunity to go to the Black Knight's castle. Ooh, not good. This frog's going to come up, isn't he? One more jump, maybe? All right, maybe not. I want to just clip that. Yeah, that's good. 
I can't kill this person. I can actually, and I want to. I should have grabbed the blood when I could. All right, this is just a bad situation. I will drop my shotgun down there because that will also, yeah, that'll kill him. Perfect, and we got some health from it as well. Definitely a huge opportunity to get blood as well as money here, but I'm not interested in either. There we go. I am interested in this crate though. That would be, ooh, got three bombs out of it. Very nice. This idol looks pretty delicious over here too, but you know what? I'm just going to curb my enthusiasm, never watch the show, don't worry, and just say no to drugs there, because that would be ideal as well. Fuck you, monkey. You are a jerk. Oh, look how much money we have now. Or, look how much health we have now. We had one in the black market, mind you, so... Isn't that just awesome? Shit. Alright, that's fine. Everyone can kill each other here. I need to use a rope, I think. Was not gonna mess around with that man. What is this, Mega Man? I don't even know. Okay, could we got through? Wow, that felt like pulling teeth. We can drop down here. That's that's cool. That's cool. We're good here. Yeah, those these frogs can kill each other or kill themselves, mind you. Ooh, we can even get our damsel here, which is definitely ideal. And a ruby. Oh shit! I got hit. That was obviously a mistake. That's what you get for not playing careful, though, once again. And obviously, that's literally the name of the game. Splunky, a.k.a. Play the Game Careful. That's like the subtitle. You know how movies have, like, the original title or whatever, and they have the subtitle? Yeah, that's that's the subtitle of this game. Let's just get the hell out of here. <laughs> Before I kill anything, including myself. Although I'd really like to kill things, I, I, I just can't do it right now. We got another Dead is Restless level, so hey, we can get a second shotgun if we feel like getting some you know overkill chronicles but okay we can still focus on getting money which is nice and we can still go to the black knight's castle with a shotgun i think that might be kind of nice but from what i've seen of it you have to be really careful about what you do in the black knight's castle because there are some bad stuffs going on oh well we can possibly grab our damsel and i'm gonna grab the idol i mean why would you not if you have the opportunity to so, I mean, you do have to deal with a ghost, unfortunately, but that's okay. We've done it before. It's not like it's a foreign, you know, opportunity for us, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. I want to get up here, and I'm comfortable using the bomb because we have spring shoes. So that means we can jump around, as I said, and I think in the last episode, the House of Pain, man. All right. Oh, we just can't quite make that jump. We're using too many ropes, but I do want to sacrifice this damsel. We'll get our third sacrifice available which is nice and we can just get the hell out of here once I put my shotgun where it belongs which is right near the door because I want to once again as I said redeem this idol you you can actually get two ghosts by the way you can wait for the first ghost to come and then you can take the idol and a second ghost will actually spawn it's like the craziest thing and you actually get 15k for that idol that was something I wasn't I didn't realize and there was our Ash grave as well if you were wondering where that was it was to the right of the door to the left of the altar cool stuff so I'm kind of nervous now because I do not like the idea of not having spike shoes in here but I also do not like the idea of possibly not having a lot of ropes to complete the ice caves because you kind of need ropes and that's really the truth of the matter we can get back to the worm level if we wanted, if we if we really wanted. We can also get our damsel if we really wanted. Just wanted to grab any blood that I could. Yeah, you guys are both dead. That's that's good to know. I can use the spring to get back up, so it obviously wasn't all for a loss. And we're right here at our exit. Enough to collect some blood as well. Ooh, hoo, 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 that was really close. Let's go before I go any crazier in the brain. Ropes are really important, though, for this, because if you get stuck like I did before, you're kind of screwed in that regard, and I don't like that idea at all, obviously. Give me that, Ruby. How nice of you. Would really like... Eh, well, I can't even sacrifice it. Ooh, the Moai head is on this level. Unfortunately, though, sacrificing the damsel, we can't really do that. We actually have to save the damsel, because we want health going into the next area. Ooh, and we got ropes. That's huge for us. Do not want to upset the natural balance of things over here, so 
I have to come back this way eventually, correct? Maybe, maybe not. Might have to use a rope for it though. Although, if I drop the damsel, she will die. Oh, I have more ropes. I kind of got confused there for a second. That's fine. Give me that gold, thank you. And this ruby, thank you even more. Ooh, we'll get two emeralds out of this. I like it, we're already amassing a fortune, which is really nice. Uh, let's see here. Are we good to go? We're good to kill ourselves. We're gonna lose our shotgun anyway. So there's really no point in doing anything else but that. Those rocks, oh, those snowballs, by the way, are covering rocks, which is kind of cool. I'll run over this. And I don't have a parachute, so I can kill myself. There is the Moai, so I'll just kill myself like this. I'll launch myself up into the air, even though you guys don't get to see it, which is unfortunate. We still have two more levels to traverse in the ice caves. I had to take a deep breath there because I am talking a lot, but I also hmm, would really enjoy not dying, so I'm trying to be just as careful with my words as anything else. I kind of missed that toss, but that's fine. That was close. Almost got smacked up there. Wish I... Ooh, we can get a jetpack in this level. We really can. So that might be something we want to explore. Alright, we kind of just found ourselves in this place, which is fine. We'll make our... Make, make ourselves a little bit of a nice hole here. I wish I had the pitcher's mitt. Get our jetpack, though. That's for certain. And that makes things much nicer. That makes the whole spike shoe deal kind of moot. Just, oh, 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 gotta be careful about those things, dude. Completely forgot about those turret type things, but that's okay. Please be alive, jetpack. Oh, good, it's alive. I don't even care if I hurt myself there. We have ourselves a jetpack. Let's just get out of here. Whew. This is kind of getting a little insane. I need to be more careful. Let's just mentally regroup here because I have a chance to do things, to do great things now. And I want, I'm really hoping for an altar, possibly. That would be ideal. I also don't think I can quite get that damsel unless I, yeah, did a little fancy talk in there with my, with my boots. They keep on walking and so should you. All right. Yeah. Oh shit. All right. No, no, no. We're, we have to be more careful. Everything's blowing up. That's not careful. That's not the definition of careful. Definition of careful is being careful. Haha. -ha. Anyways, let's... Oh, there's there's so many obstacles here. Holy moly. All right, there's a Yeti here we can farm some blood on, so that's good. We can hit him three times, which is just as nice as hitting him once. We'll get one more, so we'll get one health back. I really want to be... I want another altar to exist. That'd be nice, but obviously we can't always have our way. Whoop! There we go. Wow. Don't want to get hit by this Yeti. We did so much work just to get this blood. So why squander it, right? There we go. Just we'll, we'll farm away here. I'm completely okay with farming. Yes. Give me that. Eh. We didn't quite get that blood. That's okay. Last jump here, because we don't have the spike shoes, which is good and bad, because you can see the advantages of not having the spike shoes. You can jump on enemies two or three times to collect as much blood as you want with the Kapala. Suck my dick, digger man. But, I don't know. Oh, we even have a shop here. I'm going to buy everything that isn't the machete. Wish he had bombs, though. That's kind of the more unfortunate thing. That was close. I think this triggered, right? Yeah. Okay. Wow, I hurt myself. Did I not? Maybe di maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Alright, I'd like to get the damsel, but we can't all have what we want, as I was saying before. Um, that's fine. I should probably aggro him one more time. Wait for actually this flame guy to come around. If you want to walk there, that's fine. Just do your thing. Okay, alrighty, alrighty. Where's Anubis, by the way? That's what I was hoping to see. I want to trigger the thwomp, damn it. There we go, okay. That was some fancy, fancy jumping work there. There's Anubis. I forgot I had a jetpack temporarily. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Holy shit, that was close. Right, we need to see if we can damage him just like that. Oh, perfect. He got kind of...
kind of like triple hit there, which is nice. We lose our shotgun though. Kind of wish I could get it on the other level, obviously. All right. No need to be rowdy. Shit. These flame men are not nice. There's an item for that later on. All right, let's just get the hell out of here. Holy shit, do I want to get the hell out of here? This is fine. I'm okay here. Okay, everyone is... Shit. Go. Oh, come on. You're seriously going to tell me that was what happened right there? Don't think so, personally. Personally, my opinion doesn't matter, though. So, let's just go. Lost our shotgun, which is unfortunate. I completely forgot that you hit, you should get the scepter down here. But we're going to get to the City of Gold, nonetheless. Maybe you guys will be able to see some of the more interesting nuances of this area. Damn it. There is a thwompy thwomp. How do I do this one? Oh, I can aggro him like this. Just like that. Alright, is there really anything else to do here besides grab the damsel? Don't think so, so... I'm okay with this. Let's just go to the City of Gold. I'm going to go down when I have the opportunity to because obviously this is what's working for me. Now the thing about the City of Gold that you did not know that I tried to describe to you I think at least once before that's really interesting and different about this area is that there's something that we have to grab here in order to be able to get to hell. What is it you ask? It is the Necronomicon. Now the cool thing about the Necronomicon is that it will show you where the hell door was that I was looking for before. Why are there so many arrow traps? God damn it. Alright. This guy lost his wings, so we can collect a lot of blood, which is nice. We're going to trigger every single one of these arrow traps, because you never know how maneuverable we're going to have to be here. <sighs> Wish I had that shotgun now, huh? Hmm. Where's the Necronomicon? That's an interesting quandary we found ourselves in. I want him to not be here. And be somewhere else. They are actually... This is gonna hurt me, isn't it? We'll toss that. Down. Okay, so this is triggered already. It should make sense to me. Alright, so here's the Necronomicon. What happens when you actually take the Necronomicon is... Holy shit, there are so many arrow traps. Oh my god, I'm gonna die if I'm anywhere near this area. Anyways, you, you take the Necronomicon, right? And... <laughs> Alright, we're gonna kill this dude. And we're going to blow this wall as well. Holy shit, look at all these freaking arrow traps. Oh my lordy lordy. Alright, we're going to go... Do we have three health yet? No. Okay, this is what makes things kind of shitty. Alright. I can't hurt myself like that, but I want to make sure... Okay, that was the only arrow trap that wasn't triggered. So the interesting thing about this is you have this Anubis too, right? And he sucks because he will send his minions after you, but you also need to kill him. Son of a bitch. Oh my god. That is so annoying. Where was that even? Mm. <laughs> Hopefully you've enjoyed this little episode of Spelunky. Fuck my life. This has been Fuck My Life, Duff King 56. Fuck. I died, fuck. With the most overpowered fuck. And I couldn't even get to fucking hell. Swearing is something that you shouldn't do in front of your parents. I'll see you guys later. Have a great night. Peace out. Bye.